Hey everyone guys, nice to meet you in my YouTube channel. So uh, we continue our theme about how to create a perfect cool website builder or a landing page with no tech skills, with no coding skills. And the key point of this video is that, that I will show you a cool service with ease of use and I assure you that in one hour or uh, you can create actually a cool website, a large website. Uh, or in 20 minutes, you can create a full landing page uh, for your project, for your customers. So um, the only thing you just need to watch this video till the end. And as usual, I'm waiting for your comments, I'm waiting for your likes, I'm waiting for your shares. And let's get on to our work just directly right now. So um, as I said, a key point is, of course, ease of use. So whatever action you intend to complete, be the widget integration, blog, post creation, domain name and others, it will be very easy and convenient because your kit is logically divided into two areas, the dashboard and the builder. So uh, actually, um, uh, the, the builder has a core a working area. Yep, side pages, builder, design, and the depth side view. So we will uh, talk a little bit builder after. Uh, but I would love to say you the key point of UK, of course, is the ease of use. And first of all, you need to get uh, a registration. Yep, an account. You need to register an account. And after you are verified via the link, your account you will be proposed I would say is right here we have many cool templates so you just need to select a template that you would like to work with this one yep and start your journey with UK uh, so if you need to create a cool website or um, a landing page for a specific project and in specific area you have a list uh, right here of the areas if uh, it may be a fashion model food furniture games whatever you like maybe music photography let's start from photography for example yep uh, just right here you may select that template that you like on just right here a design process so here we have uh, two um, templates of uh, design agency or let it be business and finance yep here we have so actually one of these uh, sphere um, not sphere I would say types uh, of uh, selection it, it may have more um, I would say templates than the other one but I guess it's not a problem because right here you may to create a, the adaptive design whatever you think how you see it how you feel it for example for animals we have only two but it's not a problem because we can change the background and let actually that how it works yep or we can start from the best one so these are the best templates yep and we can check how they works not how they works how do they look like uh for example let's start from from i don't know from the apartment yep uh we have uh, a preview button clicking directly to the preview button here we have actually a look of this website so uh, we have the desktop version, it has uh, many sections, I would say. And actually all the content is in high quality. Remember the, that all the images, all the videos, uh, all the content that you use, it should be high quality, of course. And the thing that I adore right here is that we have the adaptive designs, of course. So uh, actually that is for the tablet version, yeah, we have two modes, horizontal and vertical mode, yep, and here we have actually actually for smartphone devices so basically it's important right now to have uh, actually adaptive side version because you hold your phone 24 hours per seven I assure you yep so it's very important to have it I'm just clicking directly to the bottom choose the design the next step we need to put a domain name but to be honest uh, I prefer doing this after the after the finishing creation process yeah so uh, clicking directly to uh, the continue button we will work with the editor so actually this is the place where we uh, need to work yep uh, Right here, with the help of this editor, we will create actually uh, our uh, website or uh, a landing page. So, uh, actually, this is the place 
where all uh, the magic begins. But to be honest, first of all, I would love to start with you from a classic, I would say, structure. Yep. What elements should be in a landing page, in a website? Yep. Uh, I guess that it's important, of course. And I would say that first of all, there should be a logo. And of course, uh, should be a logo. A logo maybe with a heading, of course, with the name of the company. So, uh, name of the company, a logo, and the next one, of course, should be uh, actually a menu. Yep, uh, don't forget about it. These are the basic elements in each uh, website. Yep, uh, here I would love to add, for example, a CDA bottom, because here we have a face section. Why I call it face? Because, you know, this is the face of your website. Yep, it should have cool, I would say, slogan. Uh, or a subheading, it should have a heading, it should have a name of the company, uh, and of course a CDA bottom. So I may add to the bottom just directly right here. Yep, and here we have this bottom actually. Yep, just wait a second. Some tum 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 tum. What if I will put it just okay? What if I will do okay? Okay, so let this button be just directly right here. So you see that simply dragging an element to the section that we like, actually uh, we see the results immediately in online. Uh, but uh, these are basic elements yep, in the heading. The next one, of course, should be section about the company. What services you represent, yep, what, uh, you, what uh, <laughs> products you provide, yep. Uh, and of course, about and learn more uh, about us. The next one, services, which is really cool because you have actually uh, the catalog, I would say, of uh, these um, uh, services which you provide. Uh, the project, of course, um, maybe some testimonials, some extra information about. Um, uh, about the people who are working with this company, yep, uh, some values just right here, testimonials, you, can, you may add a contact form, yep, contact us form, so you may add a map, so basically these are key points, yep, the next one we have, uh, oh, um, dun, 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 dun. I guess that that's all, talking about the um, Mm, uh, classic structure, yep, what uh, the basis, yep, and let's start, of course, uh, how actually the editor works. So, basically, right here we have four main um, elements, um, not I would say, not the elements um, tools, yep. The first tool is responsible for side pages. So, basically, here we have these pages, and we can navigate successfully between these pages, yep. Uh, we can delete these forms, delete these um, sections. We may um, just to rename them, change the direction, not the direction, change, I mean, the, um, I mean, change the order, yep, just right here uh, between these pages. So, actually, pages is responsible for the layout of the pages uh, and actually for the pages in general. Nothing special, I guess, nothing new. But maybe for analysis it will be um, important. Uh, the next one uh, is responsible, uh, the next tool is responsible for the builder because right here you can successfully add elements, uh, you can work with the blocks. So basically this builder uh, divides two parts, yep, with the blocks or the sections, you know, we may work directly with them or just to play around with all the widgets. Widgets, they are elements which we actually include uh, to uh, uh, a landing page or a website. Uh, there are many types of the widgets. I mean, basics such as text, images, galleries, we can add a slider just right here, yep. So actually how it works. And um, works in that way that we simply add, simply drag one element to the section uh, or a block, yep, and we uh, actually see uh, the result in online. If we don't like it, so we simply delete it and that's all. If I would like to add the gallery, I may add the gallery just right here. And by the way, working just so uh, with uh, each um, image, clicking directly to the image, we can add, uh, upload uh, actually the photo. Uh, um, 
from the desktop or we can add it from the library so in that way how it works or we can simply of course delete it all the same in the case if you see that it's important to be honest um, the next one design so design is responsible for uh, the whole design of uh, of the website so you may create your color scheme yep it may be this color scheme or this one but uh actually how okay so basically you see you just look at right here at our services yep so actually it changed uh a color so it it I would say it's not so visible, but you may play around with all this stuff. For me, I prefer this dark green one. Or, and by the way, we can uh, change a side background, so we can change a color uh, to the image. And of course, to play around with all this, um, I would say, um, tax content, tax blocks. And for me, it's uh, very convenient uh, because I'm not playing around uh, with only one section I'm playing around and I'm working with the whole website and actually all of the content changes in the whole website yep and remember that the text block should be not so large yep uh, a few sentences uh, with the aim uh, with uh, interesting content context yep uh, okay and I'm uh, the next one is the adaptive side version so basically you play around uh, with the adaptive uh, version for the tablet you see how it looks like maybe you would like to right here we have a menu it called like a burger yeah um, or you may add to the other elements or change them yep and of course how it will look like on the mobile devices actually nothing special i would say everything's very simple um the only thing you need to practice you have to play around with all this stuff um, um to sum up all things uh first of all you need to actually uh sign up for the platform yep uh the website builder provides very easy fast registration procedures so uh it's possible to choose from two sign up options here yep and the first one implies the use of social account if you already have one such as it may be facebook google linkedin yep and the second registration option is to fill out uh, the sign up form providing your email and password info and of course upon the complexion of um, this step you will be offered to confirm the registration by activating the link available in the email and right after that you will be redirected to the template selection page to pick one of the designs listed there so likewise you will have an opportunity to create a temporary domain name here on your own uh, or randomly generate that one and actually as soon as you are done with this tab you will be offered to complete several uh, easy quick steps including uh, the creation of the website name contact data setup adding links to social networks and other things yep and finally you will see the website editor where you can uh, work and actually approve you all this uh, you can work with the design, you can work with the builder, with uh, the pages layout, with the adaptive side view. So uh, it's important to, to, to sum up all the things and you may start your practice just right here with uh, the Qcode service. So I can say that based on the one of the best samples of visual editors, Qcode provides a user with an opportunity to design an appealing website from scratch without any preparation stages in one, two hours only. Yep, so this is the major benefit of the website builder. Any person can avail decent result when working with it. And uh, this can be compared to the work of uh, a professional web designer. Yep. Um, so basically no coding skills required it has drag and drop editor uh it has multiple responsive industry specific templates it has exceptional simplicity and convenience uh the blocks are very simple widget customization it has intuitive dashboard and all the ways uh, all uh, 
uh, all the changes they are uh, visible in online so actually these are key points these are the advantages where that's why I decided to create uh, a tutorial and reviewing video for you guys and actually this is all for my video for today thank you for your attention I really do hope that my YouTube channel is useful for you and I'm waiting for your feedback I'm waiting for your personal opinion what do you think about the UK service have you tested it or not maybe we will compare yep uh, Wix for example lead pages and you kit soon so uh, thank you for your attention I wait for your likes shares comments as usual all the links are uh, actually they will be under the video episode in the description as always and see ya bye